Hi everyone, I'm Mark Edward Willows with the latest in entertainment news. Walt Wiley, who starred as Jackson Montgomery on ABC's All My Children for many years, is returning back to daytime television. The actor is going to be now on General Hospital, and get this ironic twist, he will be playing the same character, Jackson Montgomery. Should be interesting, Walt will make his debut in July on the show, and he said, and I quote, I am really looking forward to coming to the program and working with a lot of my old friends. Remember Donnie Most, old Ralph Melf from Happy Days from the 1970s? Well, it turns out that the actor is quite a singer these days. He just put out a new CD called New York High, and it is available on his website. So if you go to Donnie Most, you will find it there and you can order it. Tina Turner, going to be bronzed forever. Uh, a statue is being erected of her in Brownsville, Tennessee, which is her hometown. And the statue should be up by early next year. And it is going to be located in a park right across the street from the high school where Tina Turner used to go. So that is definitely a very moving tribute. Prince Harry. In court these days in England, he's taking mirror newspapers to court in a phone hacking trial. So we will see how all of that is going to play out. Jennifer Aniston teaming up with an exercise company. They're not revealing which one right now. But anyway, she's going to be making a video and she is going to be dancing, singing, and showing everyone how to work out. So that is going to be her latest venture. And we look forward to that. Tom Cruise who has had many love affairs in his life. Nicole Kidman and Katie Holmes, to name some of the most famous, said recently he is staying single. The actor says, I am happy right now in my life, and that is the way I want to be. So, Tom, good for you. Finally, as we know, the writers are on strike right now in Hollywood with the Writers Guild. Well, now the latest is SAG, the Screen Actors Guild, and AFTRA, the American Federation of Radio, Television, Arts, may also be going out on strike if they do not get by June the 30th what they want. So that should be interesting. Is Hollywood closing down? Ah, let's hope not. And right now, that is the latest in entertainment news. I'm Mark Edward Willows. Everyone out there, take care.